Darling viewers, you all recall Chacha AK's failed marriage, right? When she made us believe that she's been abused in her own marriage, stating clearly on her verified Instagram account on how she wants to quit her marriage before her husband, Austin Fanny, kills her. It's the case of domestic violence. Well, another news has surfaced online, revealing some of the truth on Chacha's crashed marriage as a result of Chacha being a drug addict. But before I give you all the footages, how are you all doing? I trust you're doing good. It's your favorite girl, Ella OKC, and you're welcome back to G Centra. If you're new to this channel, you're welcome. Kindly subscribe and turn on post notifications so you'll be notified and updated when next will upload a new video. And to my returning viewers, thank you so much for the love has been massive. It's reported that Chacha Ekefani was addicted to drinking and smoking weed. Recall her husband, Austin Fanny, once reacted following the claims that he's been abusing his wife in the marriage, which he cleared the air posting on his official Instagram account that he's not a violent person and everyone involved in this case can attest to what he's saying. And for the person that started this whole thing, will in time come out to debunk it just like she has always did in the past. Chacha's husband did not really reveal much about their marriage, but one thing is certain, social media users were actually blaming him and they obviously took sides with Chacha Ike, their favorite actress on this. They believe that Austin Fanny has been abusing Chacha Ike in their marriage. We are talking about marriage of marriage that lasted up to nine years. Majority of social media users took sides with Chacha Ike just like I stated earlier. Why few believe Austin Fanny? Because Chacha Ike has once been diagnosed with bipolar disorder. She has once ended her marriage as of 2020, which she also debunked that it was as a result of mental breakdown. So few people believe that something might be off with Chacha Ike. The news of facing on social media says that Chacha Ike is a drug addict. Tracing back to Instagram on a controversial blogger, Gis Lover, who once made the rounds concerning Chacha Ike's marriage, this faceless blogger has yet again surfaced with another news concerning the actress' crashed marriage, which resulted as a case of carelessness and not even domestic violence. And this time around, it comes with proof. So, I'll be taking you all on the Instagram post and as well as reading out some of the conversations that also surface online. Guys, this is more like a private chat that was leaked to social media. So, according to the controversial blogger, the faceless blogger, Gis Lover, it reads, Hello Tui Tui, the marriage breakup of Chacha and her husband for the second time has been a mystery to a lot of people. You all know, the first time, Nami first post them with video evidence before Chacha herself come post them say, she no do marriage again. Long story short, Sha, them Sha turn everything put for my head. After Chacha husband beg them say, may she not put their matter for public. Them say Nami won't scatter their marriage, say nothing they happen, and I just bipolar. Ah, bipolar how now? Now so I shut up my mouth, begin loco, until recently when I hint on a say, there is fire on the mountain again. This time around, the matter don't pass, be careful lo. So what it happen be say, Chacha has been going through emotional slash domestic abuse from her husband, but they paint a happy marriage picture online. Guys, please endeavor to watch this video to the very end. This is coming from the controversial blogger, Gis Lover. And I will also be reading out the private uh, conversation, the private chat I told you guys about. Okay, let's continue with this. Uh, this is a post coming from Gis Lover. They said, most times she cries to bed and sometimes confined in one of her colleagues named withheld. Them shall depart the relationship to, sh to shame Gis Lover see all is well. Before you know it, Chacha begin go or asaba joint with face cap to smoke and drink just so she will stop thinking and all. She goes so addicted to it as it is her own place of solace. Marriage isn't working but they kept pushing and forcing it just so bloggers won't win them. Until one fateful morning, we Chacha we couple, Carrie scissors begin cut some part of her kids' hair and only God saved those kids. 
it was weird as there was no agreement of um, them barbing their hair or something. That won't go like that. Nadia, the husband, began call her family people say she get mental breakdown and they had to deactivate her page so she no go post waiting no good. Make with Sha, no long matter Sha. Now so one morning, after the scissors incident, Chacha used her leg, walk her come off her house, and her husband and the family was looking for her for days Oh, The husband and family were looking for her everywhere until somebody alerted them where Chacha was and how untidy she looked. The husband had to arrange people, now so them carry, now so them cross, go carry and go hospital. They had to reactivate her account. Now, dear Chacha, come write these things about marriage breakup. So, guys, this is coming from the controversial blogger, Gist Lover, the faceless blogger. After this, let me read out the private um, chat I talked about. So, and if you to watch this video to the very end, someone said, Hi, Tony, that rubbish Chacha posts are all lies. She is currently receiving treatment at FMC Asaba. She is a drug addict. Her husband is even tired because their kids are suffering from her recklessness and all the weed joint in Asaba and Aboki know her. My dad doctor is the one treating her. Now, social media thinks the man is the problem. Guys, honestly, if you ask me about this Chacha's marriage, I really don't know what to say because this news is really unclear. Recall they said um, Chacha ended her marriage as a result of domestic violence. Now, the same gist lover that said Chacha ended her marriage because of domestic violence is also the one saying that Chacha is a drug addict. Who doesn't really have bipolar disorder so if her husband have been abusing her in the marriage why did chacha not call it a quit a long time ago it's been nine years of marriage so chacha would have called the marriage a quit in their first second or third year of marriage why wait till it gets to nine years so this news is really not clear and Personally, I don't really believe that Chacha is a drug addict because if she was, this news would have surfaced a long time ago. There is more to this Chacha's case that we are yet to find out because we clearly don't know who is lying. We don't know if Chacha, Eki's husband, Austin Fanny, is the one lying or if Chacha really is a drug addict. And we also don't know if this lover is just making this up. But according to Gis Lover's first post, it was actually this blogger, this faceless blogger, Gis Lover, that revealed to the public Chacha's marriage was actually crashing. But nobody believed um, this blogger till it became a reality. So I don't really know. Guys, what do you think about this? Do you think that Chacha is a drug addict? And for what she did to her kids, it clearly shows that Chacha's case is getting out of hand. Her kid's life will also be a stick and we don't really know what she might do next if she's really having mental breakdown. We just hope that they get all these things resolved and Chacha could be able to recover and of course clear the air because there are so many questions in as much as the family is already on social media, it's not hidden. They tend to flaunt each other's picture, they flaunt beautiful and happy photos online so fans and followers are always gushing over their pictures their cute pictures so it, it will also be fair enough for them to clear the air because right now nobody knows what to believe but one thing is certain i feel chacha is not really okay and soon we'll get to the bottom of this because we don't want to lose chacha aka just like the way we lost minister osinachi the gospel singer so guys what do you think about this let me know in the comments below don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to share and of course subscribe if you've not because you wouldn't want to miss out on our next video i remain your favorite girl ella okc thank you for watching and god bless you massively